Hi, this is Corey Smith, and today we're going to be updating the DJI Spark. So, the first thing we need to do is go into the DJI Go app and download the update. Once you're on the main home screen, you're going to see this little bar here, and it's most likely going to be red, which means the update is available and it's ready to download. But, since I've already downloaded the update, I don't have to do anything. So this version is 92.2 megabytes. There is some updates to no fly zones. There's updates to gesture mode, updates to return to home. There's reduced video lag. So once you've read the update log and you're ready to go, just press download. And you wanna download the update before you turn the spark on. Otherwise you might be downloading from your cellular network and that will consume, well, a lot of data. So basically what you have to do is download the update, then connect your phone to the Spark, and then you can press the update button. Okay, so we've gotten to a point where it says Wi-Fi disconnected and connect Spark. So what that just means is we need to go into the settings and reconnect to the Spark. Okay, so we've reconnected and now it's continuing to update. Okay, so now the drone just turned off and back on. It says spark disconnected again. So we're gonna go into the settings and reconnect. And now it says update complete. Now if your spark is updating and you hear it beeping and turning on and off and the gimbal moving around, that's completely normal. Don't worry, you're not breaking it. There's nothing wrong, it's just updating. So that's how you update the DJI Spark. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss more and I will see you in the next one.